We are talking about it. October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and part of that is making sure that you are up to date on your mammograms and doing those monthly self exams. That, of course, includes scanning for dense breast tissue. So, joining me to talk about that is Dr. Trishna Patel. She is the Director of Imaging for Baptist MD Anderson Cancer Center. Dr. Patel, first of all, I want to talk about um, how do you know if you have dense breasts? So, um, great question. Essentially, we are still recommending that every woman um, over the age of 40 have a screening mammogram, and that is the gold standard. And that actually is the way that we see a woman has dense breasts. What dense breasts means is, is that on a mammogram, their tissue looks white. Mm -hmm. And the unfortunate part is, is that when a cancer shows up on a mammogram, it looks white as well. So we're trying to see white on white, and that is why dense breasts is a limitation, unfortunately. So when I think of dense breasts, I think of larger breasts, but you could be an A cup and have dense breasts. Absolutely, absolutely, yes. It's nothing that you can see from the outside. It's, a, it's, a, it's an x-ray phenomenon. It's a mammographic phenomenon. So this is something that's determined when you go in for your mammogram. Exactly. Okay, and then so what is, how do you test a dense breast? You, you now have this new technology yes. that is really helping you to, yes. to, to differentiate that um, the, the cancer yes. from the dense breast. Exactly, so the new technology, which is called molecular breast, imaging. So what that is, is a small amount of radio tracer that goes to a site that's more active in the breast. And active sites are cancer sites. So we're not relying on seeing the white cancer in white tissue. We're relying on the cancer picking up that tracer and showing up as a hot spot. So it's based on the function of seeing the breast cancer. What did you have to do before this? Where, where were you without this type of technology? Unfortunately, we were limited. We knew that there were some cancers that we were not going to see. And that's why, of course, we continue to rely on self-breast exams, you know, and, and all the other modalities. But, and, and, but this is just, it's amazing. It's going to be a deal breaker. It's going to allow us to pick up those breast cancers that, unfortunately, we would only catch later on when they presented as something that a woman felt. I know that this has been around since 2011, but you're saying it's even, it's just more recently that you're really seeing yes. it, it make a huge difference. Yes. How is it doing that? So, so basically um, last year a big study was done up in Rochester Mayo Clinic and they looked at women that specifically had dense breasts and they were able to pick up 14 additional cancers in a group of 1,500 women. Wow. Cancers that would have been missed otherwise on a mammogram that they know they did not see on the mammogram. And so that is what we're, we're trying to promote, that there is now technology to help these women that we knew we had limitations with before. So I know MD Anderson is, is all about just eradicating, knocking cancer out. Yeah. Um, if, you, if you go to your regular doctor and you have this mammogram, can you then come to MD Anderson for this test? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. If, 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 you, if your doctor mentions that your mammogram report has any verbiage of dense breasts, please come to MD Anderson Baptist Health. We have this technology and we are working to get this, at, um, have women access it as, as soon as possible. And one more thing, I mean, I just had my mammogram done and I, and I, I paid a little extra to do the 3D. This is yeah. different from that. This is different than the 3D. Okay. The 3D is still relies on the x-ray technology that basic mammograms um, use. Um, this is completely different. This is uh, relying on using actual function, the, the seeing the cancer because it's more active. Uh, this is wonderful. Um, yes. I, so glad that, that yeah. this is available and that Absolutely. can potentially save even more lives exactly. um, from breast cancer. Yes. Thank you for coming on and talking about this. We appreciate it. Um, so I know that was a lot of information. We're going to be posting this segment online on news4jacks.com after the show. Share it with the women and the men in your life. Um, and, and please, you know, ab absolutely um, copy, paste, put it on your social media so word spreads about this. Back to you, Vicki.